In this section, we're going to see how to freeze the top row or also how to freeze the first column. Now, if we look at this, we've got a list of countries down the side here. And at the top, we've got um, different years. So these are just imaginary figures, nothing in particular, that just show you different figures for different years. Now, if I scroll down, look at what happens. Unfortunately, as soon as I start scrolling down this large list, the years disappear. They scroll off, so we've got no idea. So if we're looking here, for instance, for the um, figures for, say, Cyprus, we've got numbers, but we've got no idea what, um, what year we're talking about, so we have to scroll back up again. In the same way, I've got the list of countries over here, now if I just click, say, over here and press the right arrow, so I'm moving through these figures, as soon as you get sort of to, towards the end of what's displayed on the screen, as you can see, the list of countries is no longer displayed. Now there has to be a way of fixing this, and obviously there is. If I click on the View tab, and then click on where it says uh, Freeze Panes, you can see you've got three options here. The first one says Freeze Top Row. If I click on that, and now if I scroll down, can you see the difference? That top row is still displayed. If I go back here and unfreeze the panes and then scroll down, it's back to way, the way it was. In a similar way, if I go up to here, I can say freeze first column. And now if I click, say, over here in this um, cell, which is uh, W4, if I press to the right, to the right, to the right, and to the right, as you can see, the list of countries contained in the first column are still there. If I want to take that off again, I can go here and go to unfreeze and then we're back to where we were.